<laughs> you funny on TV, Tracy Morgan, but I would shoot you in my store. Bing bong, thank you for invite. Oh, of course. Please come in. Hey, Brian. I bet he thinks you're what's for dinner. Come on, that's a racist stereotype. So, when do we eat dog? Ah, just kidding. As you are aware, Asians are known for their great sense of humor, an enormous genitalia, and respect for non-Asians, and for being polite. Now, give me big American food, you fat, ugly, Kojak, bang, bang, American fat souls. Lois, this is my life, and this is what I want. I will marry you, Mayor Adam West. Oh, I'm so happy. But you might be disappointed on our wedding night. I broke my hymen riding a horse. Well, that's the end of that saddle. <laughs> hey, Lois, I want to bounce my Facebook status off you before I post it. Is um getting ready for the weekend? Is it? Is that? Is that? Is that grab you? Hey, um. I don't, I don't really like what's for supper, so do you think I could just have some cereal? Carol only lets us have healthy cereals. Oh man, that rot! And then there was your third husband, Jeff, the black guy? Hmm, he should have been here by now. You know, Cohog Estates is a very exclusive neighborhood. I got an invitation to go to the mayor's house. Uh-huh. So you're telling me if I ran these plates, they'd come back clean? Absolutely. Hold the attitude. Oh, hey, Mayor West. Hi, Lois. I just wanted to give Peter back his miniature barbell. What the hell? It's made of a metal called comedium that can either be very light or very heavy, depending on the situation. Hurry, Peter! The flight to Alaska leaves in ten minutes! What time is it? Four o'clock. Oh, damn it, Carol, here, take this and sprinkle some in the fishbowl back there. High-maintenance gift. High-maintenance gift that second husband of yours gave me. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, hey, Lois, can I have a Quahog sweatshirt? Show up, Peter, but only if you count to five and still want it. Oh, boy! One, two, three, four... Ah, I don't want it anymore. But y you got it because Cheryl Teague's car broke down in front of your house. What? Yeah, and she decided that while she's waiting for AAA, that she would wash it with a big wet sponge. Yeah, there's lots of soap, and, and some of it is running down her boobs, all runny and booby. Carol, a woman needs to feel safe whether in the workplace or at home. And being a sexy woman doesn't give a man the right to touch you there. W wait, that's the speech I'm giving at the Rape Crisis Center tomorrow. You know what? I'm just going to whistle. Non-existence. No past, no future, no universe. We're totally alone. Oh my god. This is worse than when I went to that Arab Sweet Sixteen. Well, oh, see, we're outside the space-time continuum, so no flashbacks. You know, no back, no forward. Kind of interesting. Scientifically. <laughs>